If you're in or around Alcoa Highway, let's say on or around, you may have heard some loud noises today. Not necessarily the traffic. That may have been it as well, but we're talking about explosions near the road. Well, TDOT calls it blasting. It's part of their Alcoa Highway expansion project. Our Jared Austin shows us the plan. Planned explosions along what's usually a busy road is all a part of TDOT's plan. This is a massive project. It's going to widen that roadway um, from two lanes to three lanes in each direction. To widen the road, TDOT has to remove dirt and rocks from this hill. It's something they very rarely do for projects. We're trying to make sure people can get to and from their destinations as safely and as efficiently as possible. So while these explosions happen every so often, it likely means you'll be stuck in rolling roadblocks if you're on Alcoa Highway. If you take that as a way to commute to work or as a way to school, you can, you can expect to have some sort of disruption typically every day. Will Dahmer Muth is a junior at UT living about a mile from the blasting project. He's gotten stuck on Alcoa Highway waiting on the bus just to get to campus. And it's kind of frustrating when you have classes to get to, when you have exams. It, so you really have to be careful about what time you take the bus. While inconvenient for your travel time, TDOT says rolling roadblocks are necessary for your safety. This is a very complicated project. Uh, it's something that has a lot of moving parts. Uh, anytime that you're using explosives, you have to make sure that you're using extreme care. These explosions, just a piece of the future for Alcoa Highway. In South Knox County, Jared Austin, WVLT News. Well, TDOT says they also have two new bridges in roundabouts just south of UT Medical Center. The total cost for all of this, about $180 million. All right, let's give you.